Hey traders, Mike Sir here. Welcome back to my channel. I've been a trader coach and mentor to thousands of students for the past 16 plus years. And what I strive to do on a daily basis is to help traders become successful and help them achieve their financial goals. And this is one of the reasons why I started this YouTube channel so you guys can benefit from my knowledge, my experiences, and learn from the top traders in the world. One resource that I use and is also one of my favorite books is called The Talent Code. Now it's not a stock market or financial book, but rather it talks about how talent can be taught and nurtured until you become a world-class talent in whatever skill that you choose. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you the lessons that I took from this book and how I apply them to help my students become top traders. So let's get started. Are you aware that some of the top women tennis players in the world are from Russia? Or that some of the best baseball players in Major League Baseball come from the Dominican Republic? Or that so many talented soccer players come from Brazil? Why is that? Or is this just a coincidence? Well, the author Daniel Coyle of the Talent Code book traveled to these various talent hotbeds around the world to investigate how they managed to produce such an unusually high number of talented athletes. Based on his latest neurological findings, he discovered three key elements for developing breakthrough performances in any area. It could be excelling in sports, musical talents, mathematical skills, or in our case, trading talent. Daniel discovered that these athletes had tapped into a neurological mechanism in which targeted and repeated practice of a specific activity actually helped them build skills and that over time would evolve into superior skills allowing them to excel in their chosen sport. Now this scientific discovery involves a neural insulator called myelin, which some neurologists consider to be the holy grail of acquiring skill. You see, our brains are muscles and like all muscles, they benefit and develop through proper training and exercise. Whenever you practice something like shooting baskets through a hoop, electrical signals are set through circuits of nerve fibers associated with these skills. Now, the more that you use a circuit, the more refined and intuitive your responses become. And then eventually the actions become so automatic that you're not even aware that you're using the skills. So when you're repeatedly sending electrical impulses along a circuit, this triggers the development of myelin around the nerve fibers. That adds vast amounts of speed and accuracy to our movements and our thoughts. Now the good news about myelin is that it isn't fixed at birth. You can actually grow myelin at any age, though it grows fastest in children and youth. And like anything that grows, it can be cultivated and nourished. However, it gradually declines after the age of 50. But once developed, it stays insulated and with you for the rest of your life. And this is also why some world-class athletes like Michael Jordan can still play basketball at a high level despite his age. So how do we develop myelin? Now this is where I discuss the first of three components of the talent code, which I will show you on how to apply to improve your trading performance. Many people associate talent with effortlessness. Take Michael Jordan. He shoots game-winning baskets with little effort. But what people don't know is that Michael wasn't an exceptional basketball player early on in his college days, as he had struggles with his shooting. But what he had to do was repeatedly overcome his mistakes in order to develop his basketball skills. You see, talented individuals like Michael Jordan seem to deliver extraordinary results effortlessly because they've already put in years of practice and hard work behind the scenes. Now, like myself, early on in my trading career, I would spend each evening scanning through 300 charts to practice my chart reading skills. But it's not just about spending countless hours reading the charts that will help you become a good chartist, but rather specific kinds of practice that can increase your skill up to 10 times faster and better. Now, this is what we refer to as deep practice or deliberate practice. You see, deep practice accelerates learning by putting you in the optimal learning zone that involves deep concentration, meaning that you need to practice outside of your comfort zone. And your practice is about looking at each small element that makes up the whole task, practicing slowly and deliberately and focusing on repetition. For example, when you are analyzing your favorite stocks, treat it like it's the first time that you've seen this stock chart and analyze it with a deeper purpose. 
you look at different time frames, you look at the technical indicators, and you see if you can spot anything different each time that you analyze the charts. Now in the beginning, spend as much time you need for each chart and don't rush it. But once you finish one chart, go on to the next chart and repeat the same process. In addition, many traders believe that making mistakes or losing money is a sign of weakness. But in fact, mistakes are the best way to produce myelin. It's through a trial and error process where we put on a trade, we realize that we made a mistake and we lose money on the trade. But then we pause to determine how we could have prevented that mistake that we create more myelin. This is why after you lose money on a trade, you need to go back to the same trade and see what you could have done better. This will train your brain to not make the same mistakes over and over again. To develop world-class trading skills, you must persistently learn and struggle, which can be very challenging. Now imagine a scenario where you keep losing money trade after trade. You wouldn't feel that motivated to trade the next day, the next week, Heck, you might not even feel motivated to trade anymore. But what you should realize is you don't suddenly become the Michael Jordan of trading overnight. And that to develop your trading talent requires a long-term commitment to trading. Now, as I said to many students who are successful business owners or executives, they have committed thousands of hours to mastering their business or their job. It's the same thing with trading. So in order to sustain the effort to keep improving your trading skills, you need to have immense motivation and ignition is the fuel that helps to power 10,000 hours of deep practice, which some say require you to go through before you become an expert in something. However, sticking to the 10,000 hour rule takes discipline and persistence. And perseverance comes from passion and passion comes from inspiration. You have to believe that you will reach your trading goals. And this is where you look to other successful traders like BNF, like the turtle traders or other top traders that have profiled for inspiration. Now, perhaps watching my tr top trader profile video series will ignite your passion that you can be the next top trader. And this is a huge part in developing your talents because it encourages you to get out of your comfort zone, get you to focus and keep developing the skills that you need to succeed. When I first started trading, I had no one teach me what I should or shouldn't do. So I had to learn through the hard way, which is by trial and error. Now I've read hundreds of books and went to countless seminars, but those mainly revolved around knowledge rather than help me develop a trading skill. You see, I practiced deep practice and also had an intense motivation to succeed. But what I was missing was a mentor. Now I desperately searched for a mentor who can teach me, guide me and help me develop as a trader, but I couldn't find a mentor who could help me. So I had to train myself. Now as a coach, I realized that it's so important to have the right mentor to direct your efforts. You see a coach can provide precise inputs and guidance to help their students perfect their skill circuits and build myelin in the right areas. It's like Michael Jordan couldn't be as good as he is if it weren't also for the coach, Phil Jackson. Phil helped Michael achieve greatness through his teachings and inspiration. And Phil was able to leverage Michael's work ethic, his passion to become better and direct those efforts to his basketball abilities. In addition, coaching is person specific and not one size fits all. Now, when I work with my students one on one, some of them need to be inspired while some of them need help to develop their deep practice for their trading skills. The type of coaching you need depends on your personality type and whether you're a beginner or advanced trader. Ultimately, coaching is about connecting ignition and deep practice together. From my experiences, I have never had an unsuccessful student if he or she has an intense desire to succeed and who keeps improving his or her trading skills. Now, the simple reason is I keep directing my students' passion towards the markets, which would lead them to keep improving their trading skills one skill at a time. Now, some students get it right away and some take longer to succeed, but one thing for sure is that they all don't give up. And essentially, a master coach can help bring out the best in you. 
And that's why I truly believe, contrary to popular belief, that becoming a successful trader is not up to your genes or your environment. You have the trading talent, you have the desire, and you have someone who can help guide you. This is the trading talent code. And I'll just leave you with a quote from the author, Daniel Coyle. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and want to purchase the Talent Code book from Amazon, please click on the link in the description below. Also, I've gotten so many requests from all of you in regards to working with me and apologize if I haven't gotten back to you. I will be launching a new trading program in January, so stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the next video.